The little town of Twain Hart was once home to author Mark Twain and Bret Hart. On your mark. Today, they're known for this. And they're off and running, it looks like, right now. It's pretty even heat. And it's cool. Welcome to the Royal Flush Crapper Derby, a race in Twain Hart solely for outhouses. The Crapper Derby is the local Rotary Club's biggest fundraiser, and as you can imagine, it attracts an eclectic crowd. New curtains, we're going patriotic this year. America. The man who came up with this odd event is Terry Northcutt. You're racing outhouses, how much more Americana could you be? Terry says the race was sort of a morale booster after fire burned through Tuolumne County in 2013. Talked about doing another poker night or something like this, but everybody's doing poker nights. We wanted to think outside of the box. Well, they didn't get that far outside the box because everyone in this race is inside one. To be compliant uh, in outhouse racing rules, it has to be a minimum of six feet in height. Uh -huh. It has to have nine square feet that is within an enclosure of some sort. It also has to have a hole to ground. The rules are pretty simple. The fastest outhouse to make it down the 200 foot raceway moves on to the next round. Well, I liked it. It's good to have some small town rivalry and just get out here and have fun. Believe it or not, but this isn't the only Crapper Derby. The winner in Twain Hart will compete again in Virginia City, Nevada for the Crapper Derby Finals. All right, just in case you're wondering, uh, they do have real outhouses here. In Twain Hart, John Bartell, ABC 10 News.